Assemble a squad of our best men. We're going after them? They're criminals, Lieutenant. And I intend to bring them to justice, even if I have to hunt them to the very ends of this earth. My apologies if I startled you, madam. You should be careful. A lady such as yourself alone in the jungle. I do all right on my own, thank you very much. Mr... Colonel. Lieutenant Colonel Jean Stockay. At your service. I only meant that you should be careful because there are criminals loose in the area. Criminals? Yes. Deserters. Very dangerous. Let me guess. One is thin and not too bright, the other portly and dumb as a stump. That would be them. You know where they are? Good day, gentlemen. Yeah, hey, hi there, Colonel Stuckey. Hey, do you mind, Colonel? We're in the middle of a... <laughs> oh, it's Blackbeard! Blackbeard, I tell you, run for your lives! <laughs> <laughs> Truth, uh, truth can be a very uh, obscure kind of notion. Uh, is it true? It's true. We're not super secret agents. Hmm. Tarzan, wait! Yeah, let us explain! Private Hugo and Hooft, I hereby place you under arrest again. It's a shame you can only be executed once for your crimes. Executed? What on earth for? The worst crime a soldier can commit, my dear. Refusing to obey a direct order. Insubordination? Is that so serious? It is when I'm giving the order. And what was the order? Well, Stakay ordered us to burn down a village. Yeah, but we wouldn't do it. No! When an officer gives an order, a soldier carries it out. He doesn't whine nonsense about women and children. Now, if you will excuse us, these two have a date with the Executioner. We must rescue Hugo and Hooft at once! Uh, excuse me, are you trying to play mind games with us? I'm so confused. Are they bad guys or not? No, they're heroes, actually, if you can believe that. Wait, wait, wait. You said they were criminals. Well, well they are. Or oh, rather, they're both, really. Oh, that is to say that... You see, sometimes... The people in authority, the ones giving the orders and making the laws, well, they're the ones who are the real criminals. You mean, like that man back there? <sighs> Colonel Stakay, 
Only I didn't see it. I just saw that fancy uniform and the badges on his arms, and I assumed that he was the one in the right. So you judged him by his cover. Yes, I know. Stung by my own metaphor. And now Stakay is going to kill Hugo and Hooft. No, he's not. I considered simply flinging you two fools off that cliff. But I decided on a more uh, historic approach. Well, that's very thoughtful. Just a little off the sides, please. Actually, Hugo, I, I think he's planning to take a little off the top, if you get my meaning. Um. Hey, you guys don't understand. I don't look good in a brush cut. <laughs> Step right up. Any last requests? I wouldn't mind dying of old age. Yeah, hey, how about some key lime pie? That sounds refreshing, and you'll be back from Florida in no time. Just stick to the back roads. Enough. Put them in. Woo! Hey, careful, I bruise easily. Prepare to taste some justice. Nowhere left to run. I shall dispose of you myself. Wait a minute. Hey, no, don't we get another last request? <sighs> Very well, my primitive friend. We will settle this mano a mano. <laughs> Truly, I have met my match. I will lay down my weapon. Never send an ape to do a man's job. Hey, buddy, you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, let's do it. For Tarzan. Die! Hugo! Hooft! No! <laughs> Don't worry. You're about to join them. Squad, we're going after these treacherous villains. But, sir, their friend the jungle man will protect them. Oh, yes, Tarzan. He was an unknown element last time. But this time, I shall be prepared. Hang on, I'll get you down. <laughs> <laughs> Did you think I would come here without a plan? Shame on you. Hugo and Hooft. For your crimes of insubordination, desertion, and evading arrest, you are hereby sentenced to a fate worse than death. Cape Doom. Oh, not Cape Doom. Anything but Cape Doom. Yeah, give us the guillotine instead. Now, now, give him the guillotine and pardon me as a symbolic gesture. It'll be good PR. Cape Doom? Oh, it's a horrible place. A foreign legion prison feared for its grueling labor and isolated location. If that's where they are taking Hugo and Hooft, then they are truly lost to us. Try to. Quiet. There are no excuses here. There is only obedience. Take him to the pit. Oh, no, Stake, not the pit. Oh, yeah. Come on, now. Don't you think that's a wee bit harsh? Oh, it is far more than a bit harsh. It is profoundly cruel. Welcome to the pit, Tarzan. When you disobey, this is your reward. There is no food or water here, but it's an excellent chance for you to work on your tan. Laziness. Pure laziness. Take him to the pit. 
You have proven to be a difficult animal to cage, Tarzan. Far too difficult. So, at high noon tomorrow, you shall hang. Yes, your strength is that you never fear for your own safety. But you do have a weakness. Execute Hugo and Hooft! You actually care about those two dolls. So predictable. And the fitting epithet for the Lord of the Jungle. You! What are you doing here? Stopping you from breaking the law, Colonel. Ridiculous! I am the law! Really, the Magistrate may have a different view. What is going on here? Um, just executing criminals, Your Honor. Nobody filed execution orders with my court. Who is in charge here? Well, that's your man up there, sir. Yeah, the one with the evil sneer and the poor people skills. Can't miss him. I trust there is a reasonable explanation for all this. I... Can explain, sir. <laughs>